Already college baseball season and the Bryant Bulldogs begin their season tomorrow in New Mexico in a bit of a rebuilding year following an NCAA tournament appearance. Former Bryant outfielder Mark Dondero has more. Bryant baseball is coming off of a great year but a tough finish and they are using that as fuel as their season opener on Friday night at New Mexico State looms. Well, obviously we, w we wanted to go further in the regional um, and, uh, and we didn't. We, we underperformed and we know that so we know what it takes to get to the next level, to win a regional, and to move on to a super regional, and we've definitely been using that as motivation. And the Bulldogs have a few things going for them this season. Number one, a stud pitcher who is coming off of a big season and some time in the Cape Cod League last summer. I mean, I'm going to pitch my game, game in and game out, to try to get every batter out, and you know whether we have fast players or slow players, I'm going to try to get every hitter out. And number two, these ridiculous new indoor facilities that weren't available last winter, like this 100-yard turf surface complete with batting cages and a locker room with a couch that is light years better than what was in place, oh, 10 years ago. No, we like to scan through HBO, you know, we like to make sure to see what, what the common consensus, what we want to watch. This is crazy. What do you think of this clubhouse, the new clubhouse that you guys enjoy now? Oh, it's incredible. We like to think that it's the nicest locker room in the country. Um, can't leave it sometimes. Pretty comfortable. Everybody has enough space. Oh, absolutely. I mean, going from what we had last year, there's nothing better than this place. Uh, get out of my face right now. <laughs> Mark Dondero, Eyewitness Sports. All right, thanks, Mark. And fresh off an A-10 championship and NCAA tournament appearance, the Rhodey Rams also begin their season tomorrow. We'll hear from Rhodey tonight at 10 and 11. I think Mark's a little jealous there. I